Alright guys, so here we have the Marvel Legends Vintage Series Captain America figure out of the box. And, um, yeah, I like this figure a lot. Um, it's just a cool comic look for a figure. Um, I like all the little details in it. The articulation is pretty good. Um, it does come with some accessories, so let's take a look at those first. Alright, so this Captain America figure doesn't come with too much, but he comes with some stuff that can make good poses and... Yeah, stuff like that. So the first thing is the shield, which looks pretty good. This is the comic shield, of course, which is different than the movie shield. It's a little more, well, comic-y, but you can see the red and the white look pretty good, and the blue, so yeah, that's cool. On the bottom, you see some sculpting details, sort of like the movies, um, but then there's this, and this clip allows it to clip onto his arm, which I'll show later, and then this peg allows it to go into that which I'll show later and go in his back which I'll also show later um so that's cool the next thing you have this hand effect see it's sort of like a whooshing sort of like he's throwing a shield plug it into there and see from his hand it looks pretty good so um it looks pretty good here but I don't know it's just sort of I don't know I'll, I'll show it in a second some of it feels kind of weird um, but also, he comes with this normal, sort of, open gripping hand. Uh, yeah. Looks pretty good. There's nothing really special about it, but it just comes with it. Um, so now I'll just show the shield and how it can plug into everything. So, the peg here, you could plug it into the top side. It looks like that and the bottom if you wanted um, but yeah now I'll show some stuff about the figure so now see with the shield and you flip it over you can just put it on either arm and just clipping it on and that's pretty easy um, so yeah now let's take a look at the figure and its articulation right, so now taking a closer look at the figure looking at the sculpt and details the paint See the face? I don't know, the face sort of looks a little sort of grumpy. Weird, but for the most part I think it's fine. Um, I mean it's I'm used to the movie one, so it's just a little different. But yeah, I see the big A there, see the wrinkles, and see the eyebrows. <coughs> Excuse me. You see the little wings and the ears. See on the back see the lines that come down for the mask. On the back you see all the little scales. Just look good. Let's see the star. Yeah, um, I'm sort of glad I held off on the normal Captain America. Um, if you know I'm talking about the one where you come with the interchangeable like wolf head, whatever, because um, I like the scale look. Like in the comics, like Civil War is one of my favorites, so this is like him from it. So that's cool. You see the stripes down there, which look good. I really hope they make a Hydra Cap figure. Um, I know they made a bunch of other comic, newer comic figures like the new Iron Man and the new Black Panther wave, but yeah, it'd be cool if they made one of this. See the stripes in the back. Let's see the white there and then the big glove. See the belt, which looks pretty cool. See the little blue loops around it and the big silver buckle. See the legs look, look good. Let's see down there the boots. So, yeah, the sculpting is pretty good on this figure. It's pretty normal, but, yeah. So, for articulation, the head can do a full 360. can move this far up and this far down, which isn't too bad. Um, can't move, can sort of move side to side, just a tiny bit. I'm just going to go out about, yeah. I always sort of get nervous. Sometimes it's sort of stiff. And then this little section here, I'm sort of worried about breaking. Um, so yeah, I'll do it with this one. Arms can go about that much. And it can move down about that far, but if you move it in, it'll look better. Um, move full 360. And a swivel there. Double jointed arms. Um, but yeah, the little glove sort of hinders the articulation a little bit. Oh, let's move the camera over. Um, but anyway. 
Um, the wrist can move side to side and then up and down. And then has ab crunch, pretty good. And then can swivel, move about this far up, and then can't move back that much. If you see, a swivel there, double jointed knees, and um, yeah, there's a swivel at the boot. Is there a swivel up here? No. Um, yeah, swivel at the boot, up and down, and it does have ankle pivot. So yeah, overall, I really do like this figure. Um, here's like one of the things that sort of annoy me, just quick while I'm showing you. The hand sort of goes up, and if you have to put it down, it kind of looks awkward sometimes. But if you get the right pose, then it'll look good. Um, it's sort of hard to balance sometimes, but not usually. Um, but yeah, um, I do think this is a good figure. If you don't have a comic-based or comic look for Captain America, then I think you should pick this guy up if you want. Um, yeah, he's, he's a pretty good figure, not like too much going on, but he's just a good figure to have if you like comic book faced figures. Um, so yeah, thanks for watching, don't forget to like, subscribe, and all that stuff. Thanks for watching.